hello guys welcome back so fam in today's video i just want to quickly take you guys around ibadan city so take a ride with us as we are heading to idiarere welcome back guys so as i was saying we are still in Ibadan City. So in today's video, Bestie is taking me around Ibadan City. Not that I have not been to Ibadan before and not that I have not been to some parts in Ibadan City. I have been to some parts in Ibadan City. But there's a particular place that I have not been to in Ibadan, which is called Idiarere. I have been hearing a lot of things about Idiarere and Bestie decided to take me the this time when we visit nigeria so that is why i decided to take you guys on a ride with us to idiarere and other parts of ibadan city and i hope you guys enjoy watching but before i continue talking to you fam i just want to quickly introduce myself so if this is your first time of coming across my amazing channel you are highly welcome my name is patient known as iawola i am a mom of three lovely kids so in my channel you will see a lot of beautiful videos and i want you to please scroll down my channel and go and watch all my family videos and also don't forget to subscribe and turn on your post notification so you'll be the first person to know whenever i upload new videos and don't forget to give my videos a big thumbs up and to my amazing returning subscribers i just want to say thank you so much for keep coming back to support me i really appreciate you all and may god bless every one of you for me amen like i was saying before i dig in in this video before i say what i want to say to you guys eh, you see this okada in our front not the one in our front this the other one the first one the man that is wearing yellow nitty you can see the truck load of onion on that bike i'm just imagine if this man fall from that bike because he's, he barely sits on the bike, what if the bike run in, into a very deep pothole and he fall off? A car can easily crush him and he can easily be paralyzed. I don't know why we Nigerians are so um, not taking our life seriously. Like we're just acting as if there is a spare life somewhere. I think he should, should consider his family. Anyways, what do I know? I just pray that everyone should please take care of themselves and be careful. And be careful because one, the, the heart stops, is gone. Anyway, what do I know? My eye don't see something for this Nigeria where I come so. Hmm. My eyes have seen something. Anyway, let me talk about the one that I was trying to say to you guys. You see this Ibadan. Please, if you are from Ibadan or you live in Ibadan. Because my mother-in-law, my sisters-in-law, everyone lives in Ibadan. When they come from uh, Dublin or any, any other part of Europe, they're based in Ibadan. I don't know, maybe because I'm not from Ibadan. Maybe that's why I so much love Ibadan. Not that I don't love other states in Nigeria. Don't get me wrong. I love other states in Nigeria, including my own state, Bini City. But there's this peace that comes with Ibadan. There's this joy that I always have whenever we visit Nigeria and we travel to Ibadan. I don't know. Bestie knows that I love Ibadan so much. He knows, but his head battle is too boring for him. For me, it doesn't look boring. Like, it's not boring for me. I just like the vibe. I just like the nature. I just love the way the people there, the respect. I just love it. I just love it. I love Ibadan so much. So I've been dying to go and see Idi, Idi Arere that Bestie is always talking about. And I'm always hearing about it. So that's why we are on the road to go and see Idi Arere and other parts 
of Ibadan City. And I hope you guys are enjoying the ride with us. Please don't forget to subscribe or don't click out. Just keep watching. I just decided to take you guys along with us. So right now we are getting close to Idiarere. I think we are already in, in Idiarere. And, I'm, and another thing is, I'm not really familiar with the names. The only names that I can remember is Idi, Idiarere and Idi something and then Challenge. And um, yeah, I think that's all I can remember. But not that I don't know the roads when i am there i know the roads when i am there but i'm more familiar with the names i easily forget the names so this is where we are now we are in idiare Re in ibadan city this is the real ibadan so that's why i want to come and see and feel the vibe like i so much, i don't know why i'm so emphasizing on this it's just the way I feel. I love Ibadan so much. I really love it. My husband is not from Ibadan anyways. You guys know my husband is from Ijebu. And there's this... I don't know the vibe that comes with this, Ije, this um, Ibadan. <laughs> if anytime we are in Nigeria, if my bestie said, I don't want to go to Ibadan for now. Maybe when next I visit Nigeria, I will come to Ibadan. I will be the one to force him like... I will drag him to Ibadan if we both come to Nigeria together. But if we don't come together, he can escape it and then not go. But I will find something if we come together. We must come to this place. I love it. I just love the vibe. I just love seeing the people around. They are so respectful. My Ibadan people, I greet to now where we low. Now do where. I know I don't really know how I'm going to greet them in Yoruba. And again, not that I don't hear Yoruba, I hear Yoruba a lot, but I don't know how to speak it fluently. I can still speak it little, but not like a Yoruba person would. But anyway, my Yoruba my Ibado people, please just manage me like that. Eh? Eh? manage me like this so this is a diary -re, and there's other places that we went to as well but i don't remember the names so if you're in the comment section and you live in ibadan or you come from ibadan you know the names of other places that we went to please just write it in the comment section so i will know where exactly we are i know the roads but i don't remember the names so let me leave you guys to enjoy the ride with us and I will come back to talk to you guys later. Stay tuned. Don't click out. Keep watching. 